Welcome to my custom interloper run. I'm Nifo29 and here's what's in our backpack. We are overweight, but there's a reason for that. Uh, we gotta craft those up. Um, I dropped everything upstairs that I didn't want. Um, there's the reason. We got those pies. Um, 35 arrow shafts. I'm not sure I can carry much more. 15 arrowheads. And we have 191 feathers. So we are day 226, and here is our skills. There we go. Um, so we have lots of meat. We have lots of uh, water. And we have terrible weather. So... Let's just start making arrows. We can make 15. So that's what we're going to do. Um, fill the belly. I'm going to, I'm going to eat another piece of meat. Uh, this, uh, you know, we're going to ruin the day. But I don't care. <laughs> Ooh, seven. I don't know if we'll get all seven of them made. Oh, we might actually. There we go. Can I get any more? We only got two more to do. Oh, perfect. We got them all. Actually, you know what? Surprisingly, I thought that, uh... I thought we'd have way more alertness. We have 31 arrows. Um, we have 20 arrow shafts and that weighs one full kilogram and we have that I'm kind of wondering like oh. do we drop our meat Drink a coffee. Here's the stems. There's the uh, go energy. Uh, there's the vest. Uh, what else do we have that I dropped? Uh, that's the pile of stuff. I'm wondering how many coals do we have? Four? We have five now. I'm wondering. Do I have a coffee? I don't. Dang it. Yeah, we still have a bear to go harvest. But I kind of want to do this as well. Uh, this is cooked bear meat right here. Let's do that to try to limit our scent. Yeah, let's go. Where should we go? Should we go that way? Or should we go that way? Looking for a signal. That was quick. Where do we think there will be a signal?
Hey XM, welcome in. And Darth, welcome in. Uh, either towards the plane, Signal Hill, or the fishing hut. Okay, let's do that. Well, there's Signal Hill. And the fishing hut is that way. And the plane is that way. Huh. You know what? Actually, I'm going to go towards the plane. You know why? Because we can uh, go into Timberwolf Mountain. Maybe. Actually, maybe we won't go into Timberwolf Mountain, but we'll go this way. Let's go this way. My thinking also is uh, those locations are a fair distance from where the bear is. I, actually, I don't even remember offhand where the bear is. That way. Straight across from that, that uh, uh, little barn, little shed, whatever you call it. I guess it would be a big shed. <laughs> That's where the bear is. But let's see if we can go up by the crash site and get a signal. I do have to keep remembering. I mean, Mountain Town is a place we still have to go get the bunny flask. I keep forgetting. I wonder if I should have brought one of those Go Energy. Does it, uh, yeah, I should maybe have. I don't know. I didn't. So I'm going to guess that since the wolf wanted to uh, chase us, the Aurora should be in full swing. No, the radio only made a noise because I did that. That's that. That's that thing I have in my head where I think that if I switch it over, it might help. <laughs> oh, oh, Jesus. There you go. I told you I fixed it. <laughs> Thanks for that, Murd. I, I still like the other screen better. It's just whoever made it, it's not loud enough. I made you jump, Darth. Nice. Well, just because Darth had to jump. Let's do that for Darth. Oh, and I forgot. We have... Nice. We got two pieces. Now we have eight. We haven't found a cash out in Pleasant Valley yet, have we? Does this actually show us anything? I don't even, what, what is that? Your hint. Oh, we still have to go to the church. We have to get the memento cache in the church. Which is stims and other medication, right? Like we need more stims. 
But we'll get them anyway. It'd be pretty cool if there was a cache out here that we could find. But, I mean, if there isn't, we'll look that way. Maybe on the next Aurora. And the wolves are up and about. <laughs> yeah, I don't know why I think that doing that. It's like the equivalent of slapping an old TV. Like, maybe if I switch it, it'll get better reception. If I don't have one at the plane, you should have one near Signal Hill and the fishing hut. Like, is that two different areas or is it just somewhere between Signal Hill and the fishing hut? as there wasn't one near the farmhouse or birch forest. Right, yeah, because we kind of looked for those Sorry, ones, right? Or wandered around in that area. You can just hear, like, faintly off in the distance that low howl of the wolves. to encounter though is a green bear one two there oh one you should uh... okay so one one up by signal hill and one by the another one that's a green bear closer than I want him to be. Where is he scaling that hill? Let's put you away. Let's make sure that puppy's loaded. Okay, that is. Uh, a bear would be a problem. Wait, I'm so cold. I'm Warming up a bit. I don't know exactly where that bear is, but obviously you heard him. He's somewhere close. This is where somebody informs me that Aurora bears are. Oh, there he is. There he is. That's a green bear. This is where somebody informs me that Aurora bears are not frightened by the flare gun. Okay, let's go. Um, let's gather some sticks and make a fire. And just see how far he will come in here. I don't want to go in the cave. 
because it, then I'm trapped. Do Aurora Bears just run at you or do they behave as usual? I think they're just stronger. I think they still behave similar. They're just stronger. And they will attack multiple times. Oh, this is that issue with that. Uh, what do I have for coffee? I want to get rid of some of these. Okay, let's get rid of you. Get rid of you. I want to make sure I'm getting the one that's got two. There we go. Ah, I have an idea. If I drop these individually... Oh, they all got picked up in one. Why? How come when I want them all in a pile, they always go individually, but when I want them to be individually so I can have more scent, they're like, nah. We're gonna be all in one pile. Oh, you think that bear looked glitchy and that he was stuck? Murd's really, really trying to get himself on that list again. <laughs> We'll see, this bear has been messed up for a while up here. We'll see. Where did he go? Oh, there he is. All right, so am I uh, correct in thinking that there is no signal up here? <laughs> you didn't say go up, that's on me. <laughs> Hey, I had no intention of even moving, but when you said it, it made me think that I have to, like, go check it out. I'll, I'll put your name on the list in small letters <laughs> with an asterisk. Let's go this way. Yeah, I'm gonna say there's no signal up here. It's so cold. I think. But there is a wolf. Oh, is that no? That's a deer, isn't it? No, that's a wolf. Let's get rid of the wolf. Blink. That way, uh, when we leave the bunker in the morning, it's a little bit safer out here. Oh. Well, it worked uh, pretty good over here. Let's go back over here. Come on, boy. Doink. That was my barrow. Okay, let's go. All 
All right, we'll still have the uh, the bear to deal with in the morning, but at least we won't have the wolves. And we're not. Uh, um, we might shoot this guy. We might. We do have to go harvest the other one. It's going to be like noon, midday, by the time we wake up. Get inside. And... It's too bad that these bunkers during auroras aren't better lit. That would be a nice thing, I think. Let's do that. And we'll go to sleep. Take a taste of that. I'll get rid of this. That guy who drank his own pee doesn't. I would have had a signal by the time I was at the plane. Yeah. Well. Actually, let's go with you. Oh, so that means we might have a signal either at Signal Hill or possibly over by uh, Pensa Pond. Which I guess is good, right? I mean, <clears throat> next Aurora, if we get another one fairly quick, um, we they're they're both over in the same rough area right kind of the same direction i mean i always go past pensive pond to get to the exit instead of going the other route but i think we would be close enough to possibly pick up one of them today's word is Dislogia or dislogia? Dysgia. What? <laughs> I don't know. I'm going to look at the word. Uh, dislogia, which means inability to express ideas because of faulty reasoning of or speech due to a mental disorder. It dislodges the ideas? Is that what they're getting at? Did I say I hate being cold? Because I really do. Eh, you may have complained about it once or twice, Astrid. Oh, I'm scratching my arm, I couldn't turn. I think we all have that. <laughs> oh. That's where Murd laughs and says, that's like the 19th time you've done that. Uh, we'll just stop off in the cave. I'm going to run. I don't want to lose condition. We'll stop off in the cave. We'll read the book for an hour and then we'll go. And I dropped all the pies because I don't know if that bear would come up here. <laughs> Not yet in double digits doing that, but yeah. <laughs> 
Alright, let's go. Before I go, what did I have? Two more hours on this? Three more. Okay. This is a big book. And this one's red. That's why it's out here. If you didn't know. If you were wondering. Did I get this? I must have taken this hide. Uh, I don't know that I need any feathers. Oh, I didn't take your hide. Now I did. I see the other feather. I'm going to leave it. Uh, let's go back in here. Just so we can warm up. Now, did those pies go in one piece? Yeah, they all went into one pile. Uh, all right, we're almost out of water. Uh, what do we have for leather? We have one. Oh, there. Perfect. That's like uh, 20 minutes right there. That'll warm us up the rest of the way. And how many birch barks do we have now? We have 10. It's not a lot, but it's some. And those are in one pile again. Look at that. X29. And I didn't even do that on purpose. Not that I remember, but uh, you know what else, Billy Wilson? That is not all of my ptarmigan feathers. I left 29 of them somewhere. Uh, quite possibly the trapper's cabin in Mystery Lake. I had a lot. A lot. You're just, you're jealous of this pile alone. <laughs> well, our bedroll is at 57. We're going to have to uh, use some of them up. But yeah, we had a whole bunch. Where did we acquire all of them? Like, we was that when we were in Sundered Pass? Yeah, I'm going to double triple quadruple check this guy you're thinking after another in-game week you'll take your character out of coastal highway see if you can go uh butcher a legion of those little guys yeah Yeah, whenever I say a lot, it ex that's a lot for my standards, not for Murd's. I am just taking a wild guess that Murd will, will probably spend a couple of in-game days going to every Ptarmigan location. And then spend like an in-game week harvesting. whilst boiling water so he can have a hundred liters of water at that particular outpost. Murd's, Murd's like, a, you know what Murd is? Murd's a mayor. That's what he is. Like, come to my town. I have plenty of food, plenty of water. Bring your family. Tell your neighbors. Um, I'm thinking I should just go up here, right? You know what I'm thinking, actually. Um, you know what? No, shut up. Go. Let's go this way. A 
I was thinking about going and grabbing some meat, but we're going to harvest a bear. And there's a good chance there might be some meat on that bear. In which case we'll take two kilograms, cook them. And if our, uh, if our food level gets into sketchy territory, we'll just eat cattails. Yeah, we got a little, we got a little girlfriend over there. Yeah, Murd's excessive. Look at that, 46 he's carrying. And... Over a hundred in Pleasant Valley, 50, 50 in Timberwolf Mountain, 50 in Mystery Lake, around a hundred in Sundered Pass, and 30 in Coastal Highway. That's a lot of feathers. Or should I say, that's a lot of down. I mean, I have 148 feathers. But I don't have that much down. There's our boy. There he is. Your base at the gas station. You had like uh, a landfill of fish. Oh, you know what I can do? I can, uh... If I take the, the wolf meat, two kilograms of wolf meat, that will cook quicker. Come on. Oh, really? Dang it. That character would stay up fishing for a couple days and just add all of them to the pile. Eventually the pile became a mound and then the landfill that he'll replicate at some point. <laughs> I'm not allowed to fish. Uh, let's drop all of our stink. Eight minutes. No fishing. But I do fish. <laughs> I do. Uh, actually, you know what? Because our food is getting low, I'm going to cook them in the pots to speed them up. 39 minutes. There we go. Oh, dang. I should have put my, uh, my sled down. Yeah, this pack is getting kind of heavy. All right. We need water more than we need pretty much anything else. Oh, dang. Okay, well, you know what? This will actually work. Because I can do that first. Oh, wow. You move so far. That works. All right, there's my meat. There we go. And 
and there we go. Okay, so we got 32. I don't know what we have. Uh, I do know that this is going to have to be longer. I'll do that. I think fishing is broken in... in in, I think in general I don't know that it is but I just think it is I know I'm well actually I don't know what skill level my fishing is at um, or sorry what uh, let's take that um, what am I trying to say I don't know what I'm trying to say. I don't know what setting my fishing is at because the, the fishing slider has disappeared. And that in itself is why I think fishing is broken. Even though they said they fixed it in custom games, I don't buy it. You know what? I should uh, take you guys. Uh, but if we could catch a little bit more fish, like what, what is ridiculous to me is that we're into three, right? And we still can't catch any fish. I'm only taking five because I don't trust this wind. And Murd gets a ridiculous amount. This will be time seven that he tells us that he's not sure what setting it's tied to. <laughs> I'm playing your game, Murd. I'm just gonna take you guys. And... Relocate our fire. Right behind the big old bear butt. You think my game is a bit glitchy? That's possible too. Oh, am I still getting a temperature from that? Because that was mighty warm. Oh. Okay. Get that on there. Let's get that on there. Let's check. Uh. Okay, good. I'll take five. You don't think... Well, yeah, the, the moose... The moose issue... That we have... Um, the horrible, horrible fishing... I reach you. We got 19 minutes. That'll work. You just think custom interloper fish is sparse. Okay, no more cooking, I guess. Uh, grab our pots, though. We only need nine kilograms of this, so we might lose a little bit of condition, but we will be done harvesting. Drop any of this gear. Oh, it's getting dark out here. Time to look for shelter. All right. Uh, let's pull you out. Uh, where are we going? Are we gonna? Yeah, let's just go to the barn. We don't need to take everything 
to the farmhouse, do we? Spread the meat out a little bit. Do you think we can get an Aurora? Looks pretty clear. Let's get inside. Uh, let's put that away. I'm just going to drop these all in a pile. Uh, they are not going to stay here. way too much alertness to be going to bed and I don't want to cook more meat and just waste more uh, you know what I could do though these crates can be taken by hand I gotta eat and drink We can kill some time taking down these crates. I think there was one more, wasn't there? Oh, okay. There's two here. what we're doing we're gonna eat that oh damn it I forgot to grab my pie <laughs> luckily we left these tracks we will follow our own tracks right back to where my pie is oh and I made coffee didn't I I'm gonna drink one of them because I really wanted to get blinded. <laughs> there we go. That's where we're uh, gonna be going right there. When the new patch drops, you'll see how the custom settings options are like. Then you'll look at mods for controlling the custom settings better. You want more control. I don't mind how things are. I, I really don't. Like, provided they're working properly. It will be very interesting. Um, we're going to go to Plez uh, 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 Pensa Pond <laughs> and then we'll work our way to Signal Hill. Um, 
It'll be interesting because they said they were putting more options, but I don't think that was right away. Was it? Like, I don't know that that's going to be right in this uh, final drop of the DLC. I think that was going to come later after episode five. I might be wrong, but I'll be very interested in seeing what what those changes are. Really? Where's a green deer? Why aren't the deer green? All right, well, I don't want to deal with you the entire time, so let's just... Blink. Yeah. What will be very interesting, though, is if they change it so that you can play with base interloper and literally just add guns, which in turn would also add gun cleaning kits and bullets. Cold. Uh... Or give you the ability to add knives or hatchets so that people can play interloper a little easier but still have as much of the interloper experiences as possible because I know I know people watch mine and they they absolutely some people based on their comments absolutely hate the fact that the word interloper is in my run and i don't care if it triggers them suck it right but God, yeah. Freezing. if they changed it so that uh because i'm not even i'm not even against having to craft my own knife and hatchet i'm not against that uh, what I'm against is not finding stuff and just in adding the guns which I'm always going to do regardless because uh, I paid money and basically doubled the cost of, of this game to myself in order to have a lot of those items um, I, I would personally, if I could just click a button to say add the guns and then I don't have to change my loot at all, right? Because right now you have to change the, the baseline resource, which changes your loot. Where am I heading? I don't know. I'm talking. I, I need to go this way. I also need to take that out because that'll come in handy I know right I should have just went straight across I wasn't even thinking of that I was thinking that I was leaving the farmhouse and then I got across the bridge and then turn but in my defense I will say that I have left Pensa Pond I'm not sure I thinking I was headed to the farmhouse and ended up over here <laughs> so What's the time? It's got plenty. But yeah, it'll be very interesting. I also really, 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 really wish that they would just allow custom games to keep the record. Or your stats, I guess, is how you would call it. Uh, because I think a lot of people do play custom, and it it, it kind of sucks that if you're not playing one of those base difficulties, you have nothing to base your, your previous performance on. I mean, we're not we're not in a competition with anybody. If anything, we're in a competition with our own selves. 
Did I miss somehow? Oh, he kicked the hell out of us. I didn't miss. I hit him. Need some first aid. How did I get a butt shot on a... Okay, I'm not doing that yet. Oh, wow. <laughs> okay, guess what? I'm gonna call off... <laughs> this we're, we're going home to get some sleep hey wait a second okay i have my bow i just i want to make sure i didn't drop anything i think it's only bears that make you drop stuff or a moose right let's go this way But yeah, that's the one biggest thing I, that I hate is that you can't play a, a custom game and have the game save your stats for that. Ow. What do we have? Sprained ankle. Oh, okay. Only moose, bear, and probably a cougar make you drop stuff. Okay. Well, we got a birch bark in us. We're going to have... Oh, what's... Okay, everything's good in there. How bad is our bedroll? 56. That's still good. Yeah, unfortunately, I've never had any experience with the cougar. You will wait until I'm inside for the stretch. Oh, nice. Nice. Thanks, Murd. But I'm actually going to get the memento first. I'm kidding. <laughs> you know what I should do? I should run because... We're cold. And we have low condition. So, I mean, that's just making us lose even more. What I don't want to do is uh, lose too, too much. I think currently even drinking a tea, I think we're going to get to about uh, probably just over half. <laughs> Am I dumb? Am I dumb? Oh, I totally want to get it. You wondered if there was one here and now you know. If I hear a bark, I'm gone. Uh, I gotta warm up, though. I gotta warm up. This pack is getting kind of heavy. Um. Okay. Actually, how bad is those infection risks? Not very bad. So we need to make two of those. Probably actually need to make another, but. Let's do that. Oh, you know what? I don't know if I might even have antiseptic here. I might not even have to use those. Oh, those are cooked potatoes. What are those? What's in here? Take that. Uh, don't worry, I'm not forgetting. I still have uh, 
Another instance of infection. What are you? Water. Boots. Okay. Let's do that. And... Let's do that. This is really stupid. If I go out there, oh man, you know we ain't gonna get one. Oh, you're right, eight. We're not gonna get one for a long time. Uh, I mean by that, I don't think we'll have an Aurora for a long time. I'm, I'm trying to, I'm like, ah, uh, I really wanna go after that one, but I think it would be foolish. A wolf even breathes on us when we're dead. All right. I'll do that. Did I have... I didn't have any meat, but... I have all these potatoes, and they are moderate. Let's eat them. They ain't doing no good here, right? I, I think that's enough. Um, I gotta make sure that I have... Let's do that and that. I gotta get more birch bark prepared. Cooked. Look at all the flour. What are you all? Uh, you're cured. You're useless here. Uh, what am I looking for? I'm looking for to see if I, I guess I don't have it. I was thinking that maybe if I might have, uh, some cans I could do even more teas at a time. But what's the, they're like seven minutes. It's not a big Come on, deal. Come on. Uh, so I want you, you. I want herbal tea. Uh, actually, do I need? Yeah, I need another herbal tea. That's 31 minutes. Um, I'm going to do another one of those just so I can drink it. I'm an idiot because you know what? I shouldn't have done that yet. Um, and I want coffee, but what is my coffee? Four, five, five, five. Coffee. Coffee. Birch bark. Oh, dang it. I gotta add a stick. I think the way I'm going, <laughs> I'm gonna do that. Pick up my coffee. Uh, I might take one of those. I wonder, I, I, you know what? I don't have I if I can drop any, of this gear. any of that stuff here. I'm taking that here. I'm taking it with me. And we will drop it off somewhere else. I'll take that go energy. And... That's 45 minutes. I got to repair it before I forget. Oh my. What are the odds that we'll get an Aurora tonight? 
we still have to go back to the farmhouse and get some actual meat. What is that? Okay. We need some meat. But now we know somewhere over there there's a uh, a cache. We're going to go into the church. We're going to get the uh, memento cash. Oh, the eight ball says we won't get one. Oh, Murd wants a stretch. Will this work? <clears throat> oh. <laughs> there we go. Thanks, Murd. Thanks for waiting. <laughs> Three stems. Oh, I can't. I, I think I probably tried that before. There we go. All right. Well, let's uh, take a little bit of a stroll. What do we got here? Restore condition is pretty good. Uh, let's take a little bit of a stroll through the uh, birch forest. Uh, we'll pick up sticks. I'm not going to go crazy out of my way. This Pretty close to in our path should work. We'll go gather some, uh, a little bit of birch bark. Oh, where are you? Who'd you bark at? You couldn't have been barking at me. Uh, sorry, little bunny. Yeah, I'm not going to do a crazy search through here. I'm just going to kind of pick a path and see if the moose is back because, you know, reasons. We'll see. I would love to get another Aurora because I'm interested in knowing what's in that cache. You thought you were crazy. Glad you also acknowledged the bunny getting bit. <laughs> I always do. Hey, if I if I direct a wolf towards a bunny and the bunny gets taken out and it saves my life, I leave two sticks in honor of the bunny. That I had nothing to do with, but hey, ain't nobody needs to die. Except for those with teeth. Hello. Hello. You look so lonely. Get into my backpack. And I need, um, we have two of you and three, so we need a bunch. Used to be we needed three more. Now I'm like, I need six more. I've upped it from wanting two spares. Oh, that was perfect. Two on one and a third on the other. Nice. I've upped it from wanting to, enough to make two bandages to ha wanting to have enough to make three bandages. Look at all the sticks. Mother Nature, you're making a mess of this place. Uh, 
Um, did I miss the moose? Is it in there? Oh. No. If I missed the moose spot, I didn't do it on purpose. I don't even know where the hell am I? Why is there... What? I went around the moose spot. <laughs> Going an odd knife path. Where? It's just through those rocks. Isn't it? I don't know. We'll check. I didn't intentionally avoid it. It's the time. It's almost nighttime. See, this is the perfect night to get an Aurora where I actually have a lot of alertness. You're going to hit your head against the wall with my sense of direction. I am going in a direction that I've not accustomed to going. I don't even know. I'm going back this way. I think somehow I got messed up on my, my direction. I mean, I know where the spot is. I do. I hear something. Oh, it's a deer. Oh, dear. See? Birch forest. I was headed in the right way. It's just right there. Did I just... Is it because I walked by it that, again? <laughs> Let's go over here. I could probably actually run because we do have an awful lot of alertness. I see moose markings. How many sticks are we at? Oh, oh dude, look at that. Na -na 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 -na. X29. <laughs> yeah, maintain the suspense. I don't see one. I don't hear one. Oh, no moose. Okay, right, let's go back. What do we have for food? Potatoes. Let's just eat the potatoes. Um, I guess since I have those ingredients, I, I think we should go back to the farmhouse and guaranteed if we go to the farmhouse, we're going to get an Aurora. Which means I'm going to have to, I want to come all the way back to this side, but I want those ingredients over at the farmhouse where the skillets are and where we have, I think we have the meat to, to use it or we might have to go hunt some more deer and just, uh, I know that you can use a, a full kilogram piece and it just takes half of that piece. Yeah, that's what we'll do. That's what we do. I'm not gonna... I was briefly considering thinking like maybe I would harvest the deer in 0.5s. But... Screw it. We'll just get a deer, harvest it properly.
That way we have enough to make uh, more carry pies. Hey, little bunnies. Now, what do we have? We have zero. And all of a sudden we have four. You've killed this moose three times from that large fallen tree. Which large fallen tree? Not the one out in the lake, right? Like, did you sneak over to it? I am way past it now. No, not the lake one. Oh, okay. So like within the birch forest, kind of over by the beginning of it, I guess. Is that a wolf? I think it's a deer. I'm looking like right there. That thing. I think that's a deer. What do we have for birch bark? We have four. Good enough. Uh, we have four plus, uh, well, we have nine, but we also have three cups. And I believe these stack, so we should have. Eh, it didn't stack as much as I was hoping. Maybe it's not uh, beneficial to try to stack them. Because shouldn't one cup almost fill that restore condition? Did I literally just waste one? That's a deer. I would prefer to get one of the deer in front of the farmhouse though, honestly. I'm going to keep this out just in case because if I get a good shot on this deer, um, that'd probably be all right. I would also prefer if it was a big fat juicy buck and that looks like a tasty little doe. You're unsure if birch barks Dax. Never tested it, truth be told. Well, it does... Okay. I thought I heard a snarl. Maybe it was just that doe running. Uh, it does stack because this was like down here. But it only gave me that much. So I think... <clears throat> I think it's best to not try to drink it until you're done. Because I do think that that, that like one birch bark tea would usually f come close to filling that. I, th I don't remember. That also could be bugged though. I mean. There's a few things that have gone nuts in this game that need to be fixed at some point. It's the time, it's almost night time. Well, it's another night where we could get an Aurora. Now, was I smart? No, why would I be smart? Why would I make three of the herbal teas knowing I would probably... Well, I, to be honest, you know what? I don't even need to drink a herbal tea tonight. We get 10 hours of sleep. We should have 
our condition restored completely. Completely. I wonder if this will give us a heads up, an early heads up of an Aurora to where I don't have to say, Ooh, did you hear that? I think I heard Aurora music. We'll just see this thing turn on, but we'll also know that once it turns on, it's not officially working yet. I'm going to put that away though. Because I know that in a pinch, if I try to pull out a weapon, it's going to be the uh, the pistol, the flare gun. Do this, so. But yeah, I would like to get a buck out inside, uh, like in front of the, the, the farmhouse. But... All honesty, it's, I mean, it's 0.5 for every pie that you make or every round of pies, I guess is what it would be. Uh, a dough is an awful lot. I mean, a dough, a dough at eight kilograms is like 16 pies. So take whatever is out there feels like night is coming yeah it feels like it doesn't it looks like it too <laughs> oh that's just a rock showing through I thought it was a mini giraffe all right all the screaming deer. Look at this. Are you seeing this? Yeah, that's true. 16 times 3 pies, so there's 48 pies because yeah, each each round of pies is 3 for every 0.5 piece of meat. So yeah, dough is, is, is more than worth the effort. We will get so much pie out of that. I'm, I'm pulling this out though. It is super pretty, isn't it? Basement. Oh, you know what? I'm a fool. I should have grabbed. Well, I, I, you know what? I guess in my defense, I didn't expect to be necessarily coming right back here. But I should have uh, maybe thought about it and brought the uh, bear hide and guts. But that is fine. We'll be past that area shortly. Oh, damn it. I, mean, I forgot to drop it. What are our bows at? Do I have to get nervous about the... Well, not really. Uh, let's go this way. Cured, cured, cured. Alright, so we need a bit of water and we need uh, probably a couple pieces of meat. Here, 28. I have an idea. If I put one up there. There we go. I'm putting this down knowing that I said earlier. <laughs> That maybe I should have brought one of them. Oh, damn. 
dang it. Uh, what else do we have? Those are all good. Oh, the flower and such has to get dropped. Flower, flower oil. I'm not sure I can carry much more. Uh, go with that. Good enough. And what do we got in here? No duplicates of anything, really. Uh, wow, 16. Uh, we have a lot, actually. An awful lot of cloth. Let's do that. We'll keep 10. And... This isn't normally where I would put it, but I'm just going to throw that there so that in the future I will notice it. I want... let's take some of that. I want to save my lantern fuel. Eat that up. You scare me more with the purr than the wolves now. <laughs> Uh, that's not a wrong statement, actually. That is fairly true. Oh, stupid. Why didn't I grab water? Why? All right, here's what we're going to do. We have four, five, okay, there we go. Because of our alertness, I'm not gonna spend the night here. We'll walk out to the road, we'll see if we can spot any deer. Like that big fat juicy buck right there. And it's minus five. We might get to harvest it all without a fire. Because I don't want to cook any of it, right? We have enough cooked meat. Plus, I mean, you need the raw meat to make the pie. Uh, I just want to be patient with this, so. Catch him! Catch him, you fool! <laughs> Thanks, Merd. I'm going to be patient, though, because I want to make sure that I get a kill. And don't end up with an arrow that I have to go find. So I will crawl the entire way. I just need him to turn. Patience is key. I'm probably close enough that I can take him out. Mr. Deer. There we go. Boom headshot! Boom headshot! <laughs> Scared the hell out of me, Merd. We should make our own version of that and call it Boom Neck Shot. 
All right, it's minus six. Twelve. I'm going to take all twelve. And the hide. We're going to lose a little bit of condition. That's okay. I can barely walk with this much gear. You know what? Let's just sleep in the barn. We're, we're, we should be pretty close to the barn, right? It's right there. I see the roof. I can't run. That's why I was thinking I'll just spend the night in the barn. Limit. Bunny scared me. Limits the amount of condition we'll lose. Plus, I think it we're, we would be walking into the wind if we went to the farmhouse, so this will work. We'll be warm enough in here not to require a fire, but I will drop you. And we'll do that. And... Wait a second, didn't I have another potato or did I actually eat that other one? I must have ate it. Okay, that's totally fine though. We'll do that. And we'll go to sleep. I'm not going to be able to carry this load for much longer. All right. Well, we woke up early. Uh, what's our weight? 56. Well, let's eat one of these and see if we can make it to the farmhouse without too many issues. And yeah, we seem to be moving pretty quick. And if we run, we should be able to sleep until daylight. But the best thing about this is now we have a bunch. I was, I was only basing it on eight kilograms. We got 12. That's a lot of pie. And obviously no Aurora last night. basement drop the hide in there did I just oh yeah I did here let's not mess around uh, in fact just so they can't glitch in here uh, do that uh, we need cooked meat Probably run out of flour before running out of venison. We got a lot of flour though. 3.7 kilograms. But I get you. We got how many deer hides do we have now? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, all. 
if I can drop any of this gear. Got a lot. Do that. Um, you know what? There's no need to be carrying uh the arrows stuff. Uh there's one and a half kilograms just on feathers. And another kilogram on the arrow shafts. And I'm going up here. I'm going up to the bed. And fill the belly. Got enough for a few cakes there, yeah. Oh, well, why did I put 10 hours? I mean, I knew we were only going to get an hour. Okay, that's good. Uh, there's that. I'm not using my lantern. I'm sorry about the darkness, but it'll only be momentary. Uh, we're just going to go right out. I heard a knocking. Much meat do we get? Oh, we don't need that much meat on us, do we? Well, it's. Hmm. Do that. I don't know if I want. You know, even though I can't pick it up, I kind of like that it's there. It's just a reminder of like, you know, kill shot right there. Uh, I don't know in this weather if I really want to be going too far. Knifeo and his green meat provides some much needed fiber. Yeah. Uh, well, we have sent uh, the, the goal here is to kind of make the area a little bit safer. Mushroomy. <laughs> yeah, we grow natural mushrooms on the meat before we eat it. We should be able to make wolf tea. Yeah, we'll just try and get the uh, the animals a little bit safer. Uh, because again, we're we're hoping again for an aurora tonight, so we can go up. Well, first over by the store or the guy, whatever you call that. Yeah, the store. I think that's what we all call it. I can't feel my hands. And Pensive Pond and Signal Hill. We want to check those areas out too. And since we're out here, we're going to go to the barn. We're going to warm up. And we're going to go check for the moose again. I'm not sure I can carry much more. Billy Wilson will not subject himself to fungus, nor will I, not unless it's in the shape of a pill. <laughs> Alright, let's run. Are you by chance keeping track of areas that we've searched for caches? Like which regions? I don't know if I asked you to or not, but. Because what I'm thinking is. 
Uh, my thinking is keeping this run going until at least we get the the final DLC. And then starting a run after that one comes out in hopes that a lot of these issues are fixed. And so my thinking is doing kind of what we're doing here in each of the regions where we just kind of mess around a little and wait for auroras and then go look for caches. You haven't? Sorry? No, 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 no. No sorries. Um, I don't think we've really done this anywhere other than really here, right? Man, this pack is getting kind of heavy. Uh... Uh, where are we? Pleasant Valley Keepers. So, yeah, Blackrock, we did it. Kinda. Right? I mean, we did find one. But we haven't really started doing this stuff yet. Until now. Um, do they tell you that you found one, though? Oh, I obviously didn't find one there. Uh... It, I know it'll tell you if you went to a to a, a bunker, but I don't know that it'll tell you that you actually found something. No, I don't think it will. Well, uh... I could make the birch bark, but I also want to get this book read up. And I'm going to keep you guys there. I'm going to eat some meat. Oops. I wonder if that's... Okay, we still have our three bars. Let's go. Now that we're warm. <laughs> Come outside and just start searching around the barn. All right, we're going to go into the forest. Uh, Kind of just walk through the birch forest and grab any of the birch bark that we see. And check the moose area again. And remember that we have three bars of scent, so... Anything with teeth should be coming near us. Coming in our direction. Both bad and good. It feels like we're gonna get another blizzard. Welcome to Blizzard Valley. It just rolls off the tongue, don't it? But I guess getting a blizzard now means that by nighttime it should be clear and maybe we'll get uh, an aurora um, okay you cannot let me just find one piece of birch bark seriously there's another 
But you know, as soon as I pick this one up and I look up, it's going to show us another one. Sure, getting cold. Oh, okay, well, I was wrong. I'm happy to be wrong on that. It is cold. It feels like minus 14. Alright. Alright, Murd, which is the fallen tree? This one? No, that's not really. That's. Can you even get on there? Oh, so cold. Oh, really? Yeah, that one? How do you get up on it? Fallen tree problems are back. Did you just climb up a limb? Is that how it works? Nope. Other side, you go up. Is it one of these deals where you just walk along the side of it enough that... Or maybe it's this snow mound. There we go. There we go. That's unfortunate that uh, you have to climb up on the other side. Now the thing is, how do you get the moose over here? Just keep scaring it and hoping that eventually it runs over. We're going to have to make a fire right away or get ourselves indoors because we're losing condition. Uh, did I miss the moose area again? It's right over there. I think I would try to get them from like up on these rocks. I don't know if I can get up here if I gotta go closer. I don't know. I think I might use this area provided we actually get a moose one day. Now, Bunny, have you seen a big furry creature? Big hard things hanging off his head. Now, can you get on this tree? You should be able, right? Oh yeah. Why don't we just make like a lengthy fire and just sit here until he shows up. Great, now we're gonna break our ankles. <laughs> I think I might even be inclined to, to sneak over to that, that tree right there. All right, we gotta get inside. We're losing too much condition. Six. Need just one more of these. I guess I should, uh, for anybody watching on YouTube, I should announce that uh, my uploads are most likely going to change 
as I now have a job starting on Monday. Um, and I haven't decided when that'll happen. Uh, Monday will actually happen at its normal time because Monday on YouTube is, is Sunday on Twitch. But after that, I'm not sure what times... Uh, it might be the same times, because I'll most likely stream when I'm after work, when I get home. And the way it currently works on YouTube is uh, if you are a member, you get access to the video at midnight. And of the, the same day of the stream, midnight. And if you're not you get access to it at noon the next day so that may not actually change that may actually just stay the same uh, the, the biggest thing is like obviously the twitch streams will will have to change let's go in here i'm not sure i can carry much more And let's read you. All right, we're warm. Is it a blizzard though? No, it's not. still have three bars of scent. It's windy. It's extremely windy. It's minus 24 on the wind. Uh, it's kind of a matter of hanging out somewhere where we can stink up the place whilst not freezing ourselves to death. Yeah, that's not going to do it, is it? <laughs> I wonder if we should go into the store. Go into the store and break down crates or something, if there's any crates in there. I don't remember if there is, to be honest. We don't need that. Yeah, there used I think there used to be a crate right there. Uh what the hell? Finish reading this book. Now we don't have to carry it. And hey, rifle four. Look at that. Uh, we can do that and we can be 15 minutes. Uh, maybe let's eat. We're probably going to lose our three bars. But that's okay. Most of the time, it's just after midday. Uh, we got, yeah, we got two bars of scent now. That's still enough, though. I mean, it's wind chill is minus 12. I wonder if I can drop any of this. Uh, it's pretty decent wind. I think anytime the wind is in double digits, it's pretty good. Uh, now it's a matter of, is there a bear up there? Uh, 
Uh, I'm trying to be a little bit cautious, a little bit smart. Uh, I don't need that actually in my hand. Just because I, I'm pretty sure. Oh, hey, there you go. Something with teeth. That's what we're looking for. Doink. Uh, I'm going to take one. Do you think one is enough to give me three bars? Yep. And I got two pies that are separate. You know what? It's only four minutes. I don't think a bear can make it over top of that hill in four minutes. I'm not sure I can carry much more. Feels like minus one. It's actually not very cold. I bet you. I bet you. If we go repair some clothing. Uh, do we gain temperature in here? We do. If we repair some clothing, we could get. Ourselves to be gaining temperature outdoors. Oh, now it's minus six. Well, let's uh, go back in here. We got lots of cloth, right? We have eight. Um, 77, 1.1. I'm going to have to take apart coach's boots, that spare pair. I've never lost a pair of boots. So I think the only time you lose footwear is early game <clears throat> if you get attacked. Tactical gloves. Where might one find those beauties? You find these when, uh, you know, when you finish the, uh, the final tale, you get them in Sundered Pass. Right, we got a wolf. I should have pulled my bow out first. Where was he, though? Let's go, boy. Doink. Five. I was gonna eat right there, but then I, uh, I might have to harvest another piece of meat. Whatever. You know what? I'm gonna harvest another piece of meat, and I'm gonna do it whilst I have scent. Right in the snoot. Yeah. Oh, you don't need to finish the tail, right? It's halfway through it. Look at them, though. That's what they look like. I don't know that there's a bear up here. Uh, let's eat the cooked meat. And we'll drink the water. You love the new gloves and hate the new jacket. Yeah. I'm there too. I don't. 
Yeah, I've said it in the past. I mean, some of these items that we're finding are, are pretty good if you were to find them at the beginning of a run. But... By the time you find most of these items, they're it's kind of useless. Like the tool belt. Uh, did I still need... I did. I needed one more of you. I don't know that there's a bear up here. The belt... Yeah, if you, if you got the belt early game, it would be extremely handy. But at the same time, you know what? It takes up one of, uh... One of these slots... And what are you going to give up? Point five, like are you going to give up a five kilogram satchel or are you going to give up two degrees in order to use it? That's a tough call, right? I think just in case. Whoops. Did I just hear something ahead of us? Maybe not. But yeah, like... I don't know, some of those... You know what, though? They, they might work in a sense, uh... You know... Like I've said in the past, I, I, I wouldn't mind... Using the military clothing in a run like that's the best clothing I can use so like the combat pants the combat boots and the military jacket so I guess it does give some more options maybe people out there are like okay I'm not going to use insulation but I think in regular gameplay, I don't think any of the new items... I mean, I even question these gloves. I know they look really good, but they're not the best gloves. Uh, 1.5. Don't you get two from the welding gloves? Or whatever they call them. But... I also don't think that they had really had intended to add all these new clothing items. Uh, I don't know when they decided that they were going to release DLC. If it was uh, back when they did the poll on, on Twitter that most people never saw. Because most people don't really... Well, I th a lot of people don't use Twitter from what I've seen. Even some of the people that that were given access to the items before everyone else were a little miffed about that. But... Oh, there's no bear. No bear. Um, so yeah, like... If, if you've already had the clothing situation sorted for the game. Uh, it would be pretty tough to add new clothing without altering what was already available. You know? I'm just going to wait here. I can probably put that away since this isn't a, a bear cave. Just a cave. But, I mean, yeah, like I was saying, I mean, you could always look at the new items that, that, that come in and uh, just kind of make your own rules as to you can use this, you can't use that. And now there's some more options available to you. Uh, I think by far the best addition has been that. Uh, sorry, I, I shouldn't call it the best edition. 
addition, not addition. Um, I should call it one of my favorite additions. It might be a bad addition to the game, to be honest. It might be, but I like it. Some people might not like it. I like it. I got way too many sticks, don't I? 36? Yeah, I do. Well, if you got 36, you may as well have 50, right? I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm going for 40. 40 becomes 41 because you know what? You need a stick to build a fire. So now you still have 40 after that fire is built. I don't know. What's the time? It's snowing. We never did get the blizzard. We just had snow all day. So I don't anticipate an aurora happening tonight. Uh, if it does, it would be one of those ones that kicks in halfway through the night. I like that they do that too. I like that it's not just a guarantee that it's going to happen at the beginning. That's the type of randomness I like. I don't ever want to know stuff about this game. I want to think stuff about this game. Uh, can I run? We may as well run. Because I do think... Where'd you go? I do think it's time. <laughs> To be risky. Well, I'll pull that out just in case a wolf is coming. Or is it minus seven on the wind? I don't think we're going to get a bear from this direction. Um, I think we're too far to get a bear from this direction. And I would actually be very surprised if uh, the wolves have all been cleared out. Uh, it's possible that the wolves in the area that we're at who are able to get to this area might be cleared out. Oh yeah, I think it's... Blizzard time. Why, well, uh... I'm not stuck out here, I'm just trying to mess around and see if I can get my <laughs> alertness to go down. I was wondering if I was running up against the wall, if it would still... Give me three bars down. Uh, what do we got? I want to definitely drop this stuff. I don't want to mistakenly eat it. Uh, you're cooked, cooked, cooked. Okay. We don't have anything there. Can we do a little jog? We no running, no running in the house. Okay, there we go. It's not quite there, not quite. We got enough time. We might even have enough time for one more repair. Uh. 2.2, .2, that's 0.3. That'll go up by 0.1. Let's do this. See if we can get this one. There we go. Alright, I guess we'll fill the belly. Uh, I think we're good. And we'll just drink water. And I think we'll end this here. So for those of you on YouTube, if you like what you saw, please like and subscribe and I will see you all tomorrow.